I hope I hope you have some plans. I know it's a busy time of year, so let's uh, just get you straight on what's going down as the numbers go up. 77 in 77 Sunset Strip. Numbers around the area 70s dominate mid to upper 70s. These numbers compared to yesterday a little warmer and dew points a little higher. So uh, for most reporting stations, it's a little higher. So you know what? It feels like summer. Dew points a little sticky, low 60s. I mean, it's not tropical. But if you're out there really working out or doing some chores, having some backyard time and you're going to sweat a little bit as we continue to climb peak heat likely tomorrow but hey it's the last full summer weekend because yeah even though nine days away till the equinox we're still dealing with one last full summer and you know september as a month a lot of blue boxes that means temperatures not just the highs but the temperature for the day has been below normal it's been cool and it's been dry when's our next chance for rain when 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 all the way till tuesday tuesday wednesday into thursday dry through the weekend first part of the week and then we wait now some of the this dry air has contributed to a slightly higher in the aggregate pollen count and grass, the key culprit there. The battle next week will be any of this moisture that can try to ride in from the south and west battling this stubborn high that's been blocked in the atmosphere. The European model doesn't bring much in at all, but some of the other models a little bit more bullish on some of that needed rain. Where is the rain right now? Well, not here. We've got that blocking high. The big view shows wet weather in the Rockies, and obviously you're drawn to what is left of Francine. Still a potent rainmaker, and I want to point out a few things. Stretching from Missouri to the Outer Banks, and then look at this mess that wants to slam into uh, parts of uh, coastal, you know, the Gulf Coast of Florida, Tarpon Springs down to Tampa and points south. Now, when we speak about tropical activity, we're past peak, but wanted to give you an update. We do have a new named storm. You'll be hearing more about Gordon over the next few days. It's got a lot of available fuel, just barely made the cut, winds at 40, but it's moving west-northwest at 12, so it's got time to grow. 82. Just a superb finish, sunny and warm today. If you're going to the beach, make sure you're mindful of those rip currents. Not as many people, you know, they don't have the lifeguard coverage that you have during the summer. So let's take care of each other and make it safe, keep it safe, and man, <laughs> just enjoy. Beautiful today. If you like summer, man, it's going to be a great summer weekend. Feast of San Gennaro. We've got the Porch Fest in Caldwell. We've got the uh, HBCU Classic at MetLife Stadium. So much to do. And Cindy, the weather's going to cooperate. We'll let you know about that rain next week. Next week, Cindy. <laughs> John, thank you.